Nice work if you can get it. It's taking the world of the 20s and making it accessible to a contemporary audience. Everything feels kind of light and fluffy and spirited and just overall joyous. We start with all of the showgirls in fuchsia sequins, but not many of them. And I think that's a classic way to start a music <laughs> Martin's a really brilliant designer. It seems to kind of just flow effortlessly from his brain. It's pretty incredible. He's kind of the go-to man, I think, for this period, too. He has a number of shows that have um, been nominated and won awards for this time period. And I think it's a really hard period to dress people, because the contemporary woman's body is not used to clothes like this. I think one of the most successful groups of costumes in the show are kind of the middle of Act One, the Bubble Girl costumes. They're kind of inspired by like the froth of the bathtub, and they're just meant to be, you know, beautiful, incredibly delicate, effervescent bubbles that are all hand painted and rhinestoned and beaded. The actor definitely inspires the costume design. The character, as it's written, inspires them, and then of course, the actor's contribution. The Eileen Evergreen character is always a little ridiculously excessive. The idea was that they would never stop moving, even if she'd been moving. The train would never end. It's way too big to live in any kind of normal storage, so the thousand miles of tool kind of all carried in here that they unfurl, they kind of accordion pleat it and fold it out for her. This is one of our Vice Squad men. None of these are found things, of course, so we had to kind of manufacture this fabric and have the stripes embroidered on them so that they could magically line up. And so it's kind of been this idea that all these colors have been bouncing around all night and then finally at the end they come together and pair off and I think it's hugely successful. It's about color, it's about fabric. They're completely inspired and rooted in the 20s. It's about the spirit of the show. Mm -hmm.